Welcome to another episode of Cardi Kitchen. Today we're going to make air fried bacon wrapped chicken tenders. And um, a little twist, I'm going to put it on a hoagie roll. So let's talk about our simple ingredients. We got about a pound of your chicken tenders. Breast. Three... Breast. <laughs> we got uh, three pieces of bacon. Uh, this has got a two eggs. Uh, this is your, we're going to dredge this and this is going to be your egg wash. And it's two eggs, uh, a quarter cup of Frank's hot sauce. And um, some. I put about, a, about three or four teaspoons of sweet cream in there as well. Then some flour with your basic salt pepper uh, in it. And then breadcrumbs. Uh, I do the Italian style breadcrumbs. And then to top my sandwich off, this is a coleslaw that I made with um, rice vinegar, olive oil, and some tomato, salt, pepper, and a little bit of Italian seasoning. And I just mix it up real quick. And that's going to go on top of the sandwich. So let, let's get this rolling here. Uh, you want to beat your eggs to they're, you know, a little bit creamy like that. And we're just going to go ahead and, you know, you dredge. Flour, whoops, we got a little crazy with the flour, didn't we? Put it back into the dredge. Into your breadcrumbs. Now, I'm going to refrigerate these for about an hour after I'm done. And um, that way they get good and cold. And then when I put them in the air fryer, that's behind me there. Um, it's going to it's going to cook a lot better uh, because first of all everything's kind of gotten a lot cooler, and um, the air fryer is going to crisp these up really nice. Okay, so you've got your chicken um, dredged, breaded, ready to go, right? So we're going to go ahead and roll three of these with bacon. piece here. So now what I'm going to do after I'm done rolling this last one, uh, I'm going to stick this in the uh, refrigerator, like I said earlier, uh, for about an hour to let them get nice and cold. And then I'm going to put them in the air fryer um, for about 20 minutes at the most. So when we get this all together, we'll be back. Chicken's been sitting for a good hour, nice and cold. Uh, we've got eight pieces here. Um, I'm just going to put them on its rack right here. I'm going to go three each. Uh, that way I'm going to put that one on the bottom rack because of the, the bacon. So if it drips down, it's not going to drip on top of all the other pieces. So just follow your air fryer directions. Uh, the one I have here is a pro air fryer. And it's telling me to do 360 degrees for about 15 minutes. So we're going to go ahead and just stick it in here. Bacon goes on the bottom, right? There we go. And then the last two. Here we go. Ooh, look at those beauties. Those are cooked just beautifully. Air fried 
healthier choice, right? And then of course, uh, here are the ones that uh, came out just a little bit earlier because of the fact that they didn't have bacon on them. So let's go ahead and make our, our sandwich. So I got my hoagie roll and it's a very, you know, again, bread, right? It's always the number one ingredient. Um, I hinge cut this and now you could do this in a couple different ways. You can put the whole um, piece of chicken on there or you, you can slice this. And what I like to do, I will first want to just show you how nice and tender these are. Look at this, Look how beautiful that came out. I'm, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to cut mine in in uh, in four right here, and I'm just going to line these up here. I get three there. A little extra piece there, a little extra piece there, and then you get your slaw. And this is a uh, very very good. It, it it's got the rice vinegar, olive oil. Salt, pepper, and some uh, tomatoes. And I'm just going to go ahead and put it on there. Let me, let me get these instead. And just layer your sandwich just like that. And uh, if you're a pickle lover, which I am, you could put pickles, jalapenos on there, whatever you desire. My desire is pickles today. And I just load that up. Like that, ooh, that was a quick one. And then to finish it off, I like a little extra hot sauce on there. I'm gonna do a little bit of Frank sauce and just sprinkle it on top. There you go. The air fried bacon wrap chicken strips right there. And then I'm just going to take this, cut this in half. Like I always do, right? Oops. Just blew that on the back. But there you go. Look at that beauty. So, are we ready to take our bite? It's got a lot of steam, but here we go. Mm. The freshness of the salad, along with the bacon and the chicken and the air fried, uh, deep fried, um, it is just absolutely spectacular. Well, thanks again for joining Cardi Kitchen. Another episode in the can. Don't forget to like and subscribe.